In this video, I would like to show you three methods used by hackers and OSINT investigators to find personal email addresses. Now, the reason why a personal email address is very, very important is because an email address is a unique identifier, which means that one email address belongs to one person. So being able to find someone's email address will allow you to gather much more information about them, like where they are registered, leaked password, addresses, and much more, which I have covered in my OSINT Mastery class. You will find the link in the description of this video. Now, all what you are doing is called OSINT or Open Source Intelligence, which means that we are gathering information from publicly available resources. Now, if you are interested in advanced OSINT techniques to find personal email addresses, I'll be speaking in the virtual OSINT con conference that will be happening this year 2025 this conference will be happening from may 23rd to may 25 so make sure to join you'll find a free link to join the event so you don't have to pay anything and there will be many other OSINT experts that will be talking about a range of topics the first method that i would like to show you involves searching for someone's social media profiles and online presence hoping that their email address is either posted on a social media profile or linked to a certain account. And by being able to gather their social media accounts and their online presence, we'll be able to find their email address. Now I'll be keeping the best method to the end of the video, but I just wanted to cover the basics first, and then we can move to a more efficient ways to get a personal email address. So let's see how we can do this. So let's say that we are searching for this person. This person lives in Berlin and we were able to find this person's LinkedIn account. So what I have done is that I have searched for this person's name and I were able to find their website. So this person is a software engineer who works at this company and he happened to have a personal website that has all of his social media profiles or not all of them but many of his social media profiles and his email address and by looking at the page we can see that we there is no email address but just by hover overing the email word we can see the email address in the bottom left so this is his email address what we can do right now is to copy the email address and get the information that this person is using like where this person is registered whether the email address has been leaked or not etc which we can leave to another video or you can watch it in the OSINT Mastery class. So since we know that this person is a software engineer, what we can do as an alternative method to find his email address is by checking whether they have a GitHub account. Because most software engineers or programmers have a GitHub page and sometimes you'll be able to find their personal or their business email address associated with their GitHub account. Now, there are two methods. The first method is by using a website that I'll be covering in this video. And the second method does not involve using a website. It actually involves using a GitHub API to reveal the email address that is associated with a certain GitHub account. So let's see how we can do this. So we know that this person is a software engineer, which is written in here. I have searched for this person on GitHub and we can see that he has a GitHub page with his profile picture and what we can do right now is to copy the username that they are using and then go to this website that you'll find its link in the description of this video all we have to do is just to paste the name and click on search and then we'll be able to find his email address which is the exact same email address that we have found earlier the third method which is my favorite method involves collecting the usernames that they use on their social media platforms. For example, let's say that we are searching for someone's called Saad and we were able to find that this person uses three usernames, Saad.Saraj, Saad Saraj, written together, and Saad Saraj official, for example. What we can do is take these three usernames and complete them with an email provider, for example, at gmail.com, at helpmail.com, at outlook.com, etc. 
And then after we get a list of the possible email addresses, we can verify them using a service like experto.com, which will allow us to verify multiple email addresses for free. So let's see a real life example. So now I have searched for this person on multiple social media platforms and we're able to find his LinkedIn account, his GitHub account, an Instagram account and his X account. And all of these social media platforms are using the exact same username. So what I can do is just copy it and add it in here and then say at gmail.com and then at outlook.com, hotmail, etc like this and then I can click on check email to see which email address exists or not and we can see that there are two email addresses that exist the first one is the one that we have previously found and the second one is another email address that we did not find before and both of them can receive emails and they are active the only problem with this method is that there are many different email providers and testing each one manually can be extremely time consuming so to speed things up, check if the person has a Facebook account. And if they do, click on forgot password and Facebook will show you a partial email address. This clue can help you quickly determine which email provider they are using. So that's it for this video. If you would like to learn advanced OSINT techniques, you can check the link in the description of a OSINT master class that I have created with Z Security in which we cover advanced OSINT awesome techniques to find someone's information. So without being said, that's it for this video and I'll see you soon.